Hey, big news for the Space Coast tonight. Amazon's Jeff Bezos announced his other company, Blue Origin, now has plans to go to the moon, and he unveiled how he plans to do it. News 6's Eric Sandoval has been digging into his plans tonight. So, Eric, what exactly is involved? It actually involves just that, digging. Take, oh. a, take a look <laughs> at uh, this uh, moon lander that was unveiled today. It is massive, and Bezos says his goal is to use this to start mining resources on the moon, and that could include resources at the University of Central Florida. Blue Origin's lunar lander, Blue Moon, got cheers when it was unveiled. It's as big as a small house, and founder Jeff Bezos was dwarfed by its size. This is an incredible vehicle, and it's going to the moon. Blue Moon would most likely be launched from Cape Canaveral, where the company already has a strong presence. As this animation from Blue Origin shows, Bezos hopes to land Blue Moon on the surface of the moon using newly designed rockets. He says it's capable of carrying four rovers that, once there, could start mining for resources. We're going to build a road to space. And then amazing things will happen. Jeff really understands the, the benefit of space industry. UCF planetary scientist Phil Metzger says he knows about mining on other planets. In fact, he spoke to us tonight from a competition in Alabama. We've been for over a decade having this competition to develop mining robots in order to mine the resources on the moon. We are specifically working on rovers that can mine the ice on the moon. Metzger says UCF is known around the world for their expertise in the field, and his hope is that the university could be part of Bezos' exploration. Now, this has been in the works for quite a while. Bezos says that he's offered this lunar lander to NASA in order to help them meet their goal of landing on the moon again in the next five years. He says this could be followed by another version that would eventually bring people to the moon, but uh, he says that mm -hmm. won't happen until at least 2024. So you know, when you hear you know. these plans and these descriptions, it all just seems surreal. But I mean, if he did Amazon, he can do anything, right? <laughs> exactly, uh, exactly. We know SpaceX and Boeing, though, they're also trying to get to the moon as right. well. Yeah. Exactly. But, you know, first they need to get people into space. Yeah. And that, yeah. that's their first goal right now. SpaceX and Boeing, they're supposed to have their first test flights this year. You know, and we've been reporting there's been delays on mm -hmm. that. So I think first they want to get people into space, then they'll target the moon. It's and pretty amazing. soon we'll be able to get Amazon Prime on the moon. With a big smiley face on Just the side of one of those <laughs> <little> <laughs> That's right. Eric Sandoval, thank you so much. You got